Hey everybody, thank you so much for watching. This is Rob with One Star Views. Hope you guys are having a great weekend, 4th of July holiday weekend. Hope you guys are enjoying some time off there. Today is another one of those food dare reviews, which um, I got a little bit of feedback on what to do next. And today we're gonna do the marshmallow peanut butter sandwich. All right, so as we know, I've done a couple of videos already on peanut butter. We all know I love peanut butter. Right now, there is a GIF recall going on, my favorite peanut butter in the world. So today we're gonna to be using, I guess, number two, the Skippy Pe uh, Creamy. And for the bread, we're gonna be using regular Nature's Own white wheat. This is my go-to. And this is, the, this is the variable today. Jet Puffed Marshmallow Cream. Now, just saying that, kind of makes me throw up in my mouth. So this one's gonna be interesting. Not a big fan of marshmallow, but there is a there is a small subset of people out there that said this is pretty delicious, but uh, I gotta put that aside, put on my review hat, and try to make these two things work together, which makes me kind of kind of nauseous right now, but we're gonna get, get to it. So this is the Jet Puff Marshmallow. It took me a sec to find it at the grocery store. This was about $2, I think, I paid at Walmart. And I don't wanna know what's in it. It's marshmallow. Not a big fan of marshmallow. I do like s'mores, but if I had a bag of marshmallows in front of me, I probably wouldn't, wouldn't be eating those. So we're gonna try to put this together and see how it is. Now, for the sake of you know what? I'm going to do the whole thing. I was going to just use one piece of bread, you know, fold it, to fold it together. But this is a one-star review. We're not going to skimp. We're going to do a, a full thing. And we'll see what it looks like. All right. Let's see. So the marshmallow jet puffed. I don't even want to know what jet puffed means. All right. Got a little... Oh, God. Safety... All right, let's take that off. Okay, if I lick this. All right, that's gross. Marshmallow, all right, puffy. I keep thinking it's whipped cream, but it's not whipped cream. All right, and then we have my Skippy, which I've already been eating on this week. And now we're just gonna put the two together. Now I'm gonna put marshmallow on one piece of bread, peanut butter on the other. I got two separate knives so I don't contaminate the two. All right, here we go. All right, if you don't know what jet puffed, or not jet puffed, but creamy marshmallow, it's it's thicker than whipped cream. I mean, it looks like whipped cream, but it's it's thicker. It's probably what you'd expect if you melted down marshmallow into some type of pasty, creamy thing like this. I'm sure it's very sticky. You can see it's very sticky. It almost looks like um, it almost looks like that stuff you use to if you have a hole in the wall and you you know put that paste on there. It's like a it's not epoxy, but it's a yeah, you know what I'm talking about. All right, I'm putting this all over the bread, and I'm not feeling good about this. This just looks like pasty glue. Here I'll I'll show you in a second what this looks like, but I'm gonna I'll, I'm gonna do it. I uh, kind of put this off for a couple weeks just because it made me it made me really scared to do this. But as I'm pasting this on, it, I'm even more scared. Now I will tell you, some folks I've already talked to said this is delicious. It's really good, but man, look, it's just like it's like. Hey. Whew, I don't even know how to describe it. It's like hair and off. All right, there it is right there. This is not mayonnaise, gen a gentleman, ladies and gentlemen. This is not uh, ranch dressing. This is not uh, whipped cream. This is marshmallow. <laughs> okay. I may have to put a lot of peanut butter on here to deaden the taste. No, I'm just going to do it straight up. Okay. All right. See how see how cool peanut butter is. There's no hairy stuff dripping off of there. It's just creamy goodness. All right. 
Okay, got it covered up. Let's put this to the side. Okay. Uh, marshmallow, peanut butter. All right, we're gonna put it together. All right. And now, without further ado, marshmallow peanut butter sandwich. That we need something else. All right, here we go. Let me pray real quick. Dear Lord, don't let me throw up. Okay. Does marshmallow have sugar in it? Eight grams of sugar. I mean, I don't really even taste it, which I'm feeling, feeling good about. It's mixing with the peanut butter really well. If y'all saw my video on the peanut butter and jelly with the um, egg egg white, you'd have thought that was nasty, but the peanut butter and jelly mixed well with the egg. So it did. It wasn't bad. It was very eatable. This, to my surprise, is very eatable. The marshmallow is mixing with the peanut butter to make that, because marshmallow itself is a little sweet and it's kind of substituting for that jelly. If you guys like peanut butter and jelly, I think you'll be okay with this. I mean, that's what it looks like right there. I mean, it looks disgusting. Last bite. This is not bad, guys. If you had told me there was, I don't know, it just, it, it doesn't taste bad at all. Like, I could eat this whole sandwich. So, <laughs> I am honestly surprised. I thought I was going to not like this at all. I thought this was going to be super disgusting. Now, it does look disgusting still. So, if you don't like the look of marshmallow cream on your bread, you may want to pass on this one. I mean, it's not something that I would, you know, want to do every day. But it is, it tastes fine. I think it, it tastes fine. If someone laid this out at a party, I'd grab one. You know, there's no no issues with it. There's no weird aftertaste. There's no weird um, after, before taste. There is no weird taste at all. This is, the marshmallow um, mixes in, like I said, really good with the peanut butter. So this is a go for me, guys. Um, shout out to Ashley. Shout out to Krista. Those folks that, that uh, motivated me and kind of encouraged me to do this one. This is a go. Thank you so much for watching. This is Rob with One Star Reviews. Stay safe. God bless you. Do yourself a favor. Love your neighbor. Enjoy the rest of your week. And I'll see you next time.